You can sit or stand for this exercise. We're going to work the shoulders a little bit for the triceps. We're taking the arms out to the side. Palms pushed out, fingertips up. We're going to circle forward. Smallish circles. Think about your posture. Feet are hip width apart. So hip width, not shoulder width. If it gets too much, by all means, take those hands down and rest and try and join back in when you can. Let's take it back in the other direction. Keep breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. If you're feeling that's uncomfortable in your fingers, just release it off slightly. I'm going to go forward again, this time with the fingertips down. And back if you've got enough strength in your shoulders to do this. If you're beginning to shrug your shoulders up, then by all means, relax, shake it out. Do what you need to do to release that out. A few more if you can. You're doing really well. It's harder work than it looks, this. Oh, and shake it out. I really like after this one to let the hands swing backwards and forwards. It's not a very definite swing. You're letting those shoulders relax and the arms swing in the sockets. Other one you can do is lean forward and just let the arms circle backwards and forwards. Again, not a very definite move. Release, shake it out. Let's have a, a little quick shoulder stretch. Taking the hand onto the other shoulder, let it slide. You just push against the fleshy part of the arm. I'll turn that way, see the hand is sliding over the top. Doesn't have to go very far, just until you feel the stretch in the shoulder. And release. I'm going to take it to the other side. Other arm comes up, place it on the shoulder, let it slide as you push. Doesn't matter which arm you did first, as long as you feel that stretch in the shoulders. Great work.